I'm Bernadette with Salon TV. We are here in Toronto, Canada on the Rockstar Energy Drink Inked Up World Tour with featured artist Steve Soto. My name's Steve Soto. I own Goodfellas Tattoo in Orange County, California. I'm here in Toronto, Canada with Rockstar Energy Drink and Solon TV. Toronto is a, is a beautiful city. I love it out here in Toronto. We went out to the CN Tower with the Solon Boys and uh, the CN Tower is arguably the second to sixth tallest building in the world. We're not really sure. Uh, but it nevertheless the top building went up to the top and got a good view of, of all of all the buildings in the city and uh, The city reminds me of a Manhattan a bit, you know, kind of a, a modern Manhattan because um, Just because of all the buildings that are there and I uh, really enjoyed it. It was really cool The Ink the World Tour put on by Rockstar and Soling Clothing is a contest to create artwork for a Rockstar Energy Drink can. To me, when I think of a Rockstar Energy Drink, you think of music right away, you think of energy. So I started to think of what, what I could do to uh, give it that feel. And I wanted to incorporate something to do with my personal life and, and my family, so uh, I incorporated uh, my daughter's face in my artwork, my daughter Tatiana, who's nine years old. So I figured um, we'll do a little kind of tribute to female rock stars and I I used some references from Aretha Franklin who was the first female musician to be inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame see a lot of people don't know that about my art that um, the message behind it is my my daughter one of the uh, you know little girls that has my heart and I wanted to incorporate something with the female rock star, so Aretha Franklin's hair and clothing is incorporated in the artwork. Then um, I used a microphone uh, reference from an Elvis Presley stamp because I figured Elvis Presley is the, the most iconic rock star in history, so I incorporated that and then started to think who in history of music has the uh, the most rock star image possible and I started to think, you know, uh, Guns N' Roses, you know, these guys, uh, you know, Axl Rose, Ego, you know, the whole, you know, rock star image uh, to me, he, nobody did it better than him, so I incorporated um, a picture of him, uh, not as a portrait, but kind of like, uh, you know, a reference of him with his face ripping off and his skull showing through just to give it a little bit of my style to the artwork, so. And uh, that's what my artwork means. It means family, it means uh, it's a tribute to female rock stars and a tribute to the rock star image. The Toronto Convention, it's called the Nick's Tattoo Convention. It was, it was held at the Hilton, which is a beautiful hotel. And uh, a lot of good artists came out. Uh, a lot of good friends of mine from Cali came out and met some real cool people that are from Toronto. Uh, the reception was great. Uh, people were coming up to me asking for pictures. They wanted uh, my autograph, which is always which is always uh, an honor to do. To sign my name on something that someone actually wants and wants to keep. That's a really, really cool thing. Uh, we, were, we were tattooing in the booth with the uh, Solon Angel contestants, which at times could be distracting, you know, but we managed to, uh, you know, keep our focus on our work most of the time. So here in Toronto, we have a lot of tattoo fans. There's some people showing a lot of love for the black and gray style that I do. On Friday, I tattooed a portrait of my client's daughter, which was a really cool tattoo to do. I did it on his chest. He wanted it close to his heart. And uh, it was fun to do that for him. He was stoked about it. I also did another tattoo of a uh, kind of a Chicano clown girl with a lettering saying Toronto underneath. So this guy was just representing his city of Toronto with some Chicano style black and gray. That was a pretty dope piece to do as well. Yesterday I also did a big side piece which was a kind of a Virgin Mary with angel wings. So it was kind of like an angel type tattoo. It was really nice. Uh, kind of dug the style. He, he, was, he was looking for a lot of contrast on this piece and uh, I think we achieved that. He also uh, wanted his daughter's name underneath it, so because um, he was he was happy to be a, a new dad. So it, it was cool to be able to uh, bring my art down here to Toronto and and give some of the uh, collectors a little piece of what I do. I'm Steve Soto. 
Don't forget to go to Inktop World Tour, vote for my can art, and help us, help me win this thing, or vote for your favorite. When we went out with the Solon boys to the CN Tower, went all the way up to the top, I think they said it's um, the sixth tallest building in the world. So, uh, no, it's the sixth. You sure? <laughs> they said third and then they said sixth. All right, we'll, we'll, we'll start over.